Well, it's a common Thanksgiving tradition, as you know, to make a ton of food and then spend all day eating that food. Well, if you go through a couple of plates, it's likely that on that last plate of yours, maybe you have a little bit of scraps left over, and sometimes those scraps go down the kitchen sink. Well, Marisol Bragg tells us why you shouldn't do that. Yikes, that does not sound fun. One of the biggest plumbing days of the year is the day after Thanksgiving because all of your delightful leftovers washed down the sink are building up. And it could be as simple as noodles. And then before you know it, your sink's clogged. It is our busiest day of the year. So Black Friday, it's, a, it's our Brown Friday because so everyone clogs everything up. And who wants to be dealing with this? After a night of fun when you're just trying to get some shut eye. The last thing you probably want to be dealing with the day after Thanksgiving is a clogged kitchen sink. Here are some of the things that you should avoid this Thanksgiving. Sather says washing your scraps down the sink, especially stuffing, is a big no-no. Any type of food should not go down at all. It's, it's meant for water. That's it. And your garbage disposal is not going to help make things any better. All it's doing is shredding it up, but if you get enough of the shreds, it's still going to ball up. Sather says the best practice so you don't have to call a plumbing company to come fix your drain. Just like that, flow is restored. Is to throw your scraps away. Take the extra step to the trash can and scrape off all the scraps of your plate in there, and then stick the plate into the sink. Covering the story, Marisol Bragg, 2 News. I'll never get that image out of my head now, him calling it Brown Friday because of all the stuff down there. All right, well, 